everybody, welcome back to another episode of Final Fantasy 3. Um, we're here trying to help the dwarves. Let's get it. I think we've got a boss battle coming up pretty soon. 3,000 gil. 6,000 gil. Okay. There's a lot. I bet that's the bad guy, isn't it? I bet that's the bad guy. Guts go the rogue. Go away. Scat. Skittle. Skibooble. <laughs> the horn is mine, I tell you. Alright, bro. I don't know about that one. Ooh, he looks sick. All right, let's beat him up. No, don't auto. Ooh, it almost got me. I don't want to auto battle. Um, let's just attack him. Let's use advance. Magic. We could probably use an arrow one. I don't have any left. Then we could use an item. Let's use a bomb fragment for fun. And then for magic, Fura would be the best here. So I'm going to go ahead and use that. Because he's water, so I think fire would be the best. Okay, we got a critical. But even that critical is not that strong. Okay, don't kill her in one hit, guy. What are you doing? Okay, we're definitely going to have to hit up uh, Refia with a cure right quick. But this should do a lot of damage here. She should get her revenge. 500. Good enough. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, attack again, advance again, use a Cura on her, and use another Fura because that is crazy strong. Okay, we got the Cura off pretty quickly here, which is good. That means she won't get uh, headshotted right away. Not a lot of damage from our physical attackers, but that's honestly fine. Oh, he did a bunch of damage anyway, 250. The Fiora is always going to be better, but 250 is honestly enough here. Minied? Bro, don't do that. Okay, well, he minied the two people that don't matter if they're minied funny enough, so... I'm going to go ahead and steal from him. Do an advance. Let's do a normal cure. And let's do another Fiora. He's just doing so much damage here. High potion. Okay. Hey, those are expensive. Those are like $600, bro. So, I'm not even mad about that. Hit him up with another Fura real quick. Another quick four or 500 damage. And another cure. Make sure to keep our homeboys alive. Don't want to be... Don't hit him again, bro. No, I actually needed him to not be minied. Okay, that's fine. Um... I'm gonna go ahead and, uh... Can I use a Zeus's Wrath? Just for fun. Where's Zeus's Wrath? I'm gonna use one of these for fun. I'm gonna go ahead and, um... Let's use another Zeus's Wrath for fun. Because I need these guys to use magic while they're in teeny tiny form. We're gonna go ahead and, um... Ooh. It's between healing or... I think I might have to heal. I'll I'll make him big next round. And I can't use Fura again, but I can use just a normal fire, so. Hopefully this does at least 200, you know, 200 damage. Okay. He cured himself. Oh, that's literally nothing. And he killed him. Didn't even get a chance for me to heal him, but alright. Well, now we're going to cure us someone else that isn't dead, which is slightly annoying. Okay, we're going to go ahead and Phoenix down him. I'm not going to cure him because... Hmm. I think it might be slower. Whatever, I'm just going to go ahead and do it anyway. Let's go ahead and hit up a Thunder, level 2. Let's see if that does more than 200. Okay, he almost just killed him. Don't kill him. Okay, that's gonna in unintentionally heal the person that we kind of need healed, so honestly not even mad about that. Let's hit up a phoenix down. Hopefully he doesn't hit him right away. That'd be kind of annoying. Mm. Probably gonna have to use another Zeus's Wrath because I'm small. Let's just 
Honestly, screw it, man. We got them. We're never going to use them in this game, so we might as well use them when we can. Let's use Kira on Ingus. And as always, let's hit him up with the Thunder, which does run 200, so it's not even that bad. 300. That's and he's dead. Perfect. Perfect. Ain't even worried about it. I'm telling you, those items, you're like, oh, I'll use them when I need them. And you never end up using them because what's with in what situation other than me being small would that be used? You know what I'm saying? So I'm not I'm not that type of guy. I'm gonna use them when I need to use them. Right then I needed to use them. Obtained horn of ice? Nice. Helping the dwarves. He vanished. Anyway, let's bring the horn back to the dwarves. Let's open these chests. Can I not open them? Bro. Wait, 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 wait. I didn't heal yet. Okay, I don't think we can actually open these treasures. It's just a little bit of a shame. I, I would think that'd be like genius for me to, you know. That's right. Let's go ahead and uh, head back out. Okay, <clears throat> we've made it out of that dungeon. Why is there a shadow behind me? Okay. Fair enough, dude. Fair enough. Let's quickly, before we go to that shrine, see our boys back up. One of our dudes died. <clears throat> so, go ahead and uh, get a little bit of this action right here. Get a little revive, and then let's go back. Get ourselves a little sleepy sleep. Everything is nice and restored. Okay, we can head back to the altar now. Ooh, okay. Let's talk to this guy then. Lolly ho, lolly ho. Thank you for returning the horn. Put it back on the shrine beside the other. I'll take down the ward. Here we go. You can approach the shrine now and put the horn back where it belongs. Ha ha ha, I was disguised as your shadow. Thanks for leading me up onto the shrine. Now both horns are mine. Steals the horns of ice. What? How do you do that? Why do you keep stealing the horns in the first place? You silly twits. These are the horns of ice. Ward These are the horns of ice. Wards against the fire crystal's flame. They are the key to the tunnel leading to the crystal. Now that I have them both, the power of the fire of crystal is mine. Mine. Terrible at reading. Okay, that's not good. Now both have been stolen. He must have gone to the mountain to the north. Please take the horns back from that scoundrel. On we go. Fire crystals and danger wars are light. You have to hurry. He took both horns of ice and ran away to the cave of the north. We're in big, big trouble. Okay. I guess that is where we head next, right? Looks like it. Okay, so we probably go through here and oop, did not mean to go back in here. As always, do a quick savey save. So I'm guessing we have to do we have to just go around very, very quickly and go to the other cave. Might even just like 
get off right here. All right, now we're here. Okay, everybody, so let's go ahead and enter this cave, but before we do, it has been actually quite a while, and I did a lot of grinding, so I forgot what level we left off at. It's speaking. I was probably at like 16, 17 maybe, so I got everyone to 20. Um, so now everyone basically has HP into the 400s, and their, you know, their jobs are, um, much, much higher and stuff like that. So, just wanted to let you know, um, <clears throat> did do quite a bit of grinding, so now we can go into the Molten Cave. Do, do we get hurt if we step on that? Like, I don't know. I remember in Chrono Cross when there was a lava pit, you'd actually get hurt. Oh. Okay, so this is just like the other game. You do get hurt if you step in that. Okay. So we'll probably need Arctic Wind. Do we have to use an Arctic Wind item? Can I like... Okay, so I don't think there's anything that could uh, slow my damage, so uh, I guess I'll just have to be quick about it. Ooh, a land turtle. Am I a manual battle? Okay. Attack, attack, magic. Probably Blizzard will help here, but I don't have Blizzard, so... I'll just attack like normal, and then we'll use Blizzard on, uh, Raphael. Okay. <clears throat> Let's see how strong this thing is. 200? 400? Okay, it does like 100-something damage. But once again, um, <clears throat> um, Blizzard, because I, um, leveled up so much and grinded, this should probably be a lot tougher than it actually is. So... I'm hoping this dungeon's pretty easy, just because I literally spent like an hour on Reddit and just like auto battling. Um, let's see what's our HP. Alright, we're good. We'll use some cures in a minute here. Hopefully, I didn't go to the right place all at once. Okay, we're gonna take some more damage here. Okay, what is this? Another chest. Okay, a phoenix down. What's our health looking like? Alright, we're probably good for another run here. Let's see, where does this take us? Okay, back into the lava we go. <clears throat> Impact claws. Ooh, I could put those on a monk if, uh, if I had one. Once again, y'all know my disappointment with monks. Another phoenix down. Okay, and a chest lever thingy. Okay. Secret door. I love secret doors. Let's go see what's inside. Ooh, are we get? Is this the boss already? That was extremely quick. Maybe I'll have to do some exploring on the way out. Okay, let's go ahead and get everyone a cure. Let's head right in. This is the boss already, dude. We're smack. We smashed through that dungeon. Not even two, three minutes. Ah oh, ha ha! I have the power of fire. I can feel it cursing through my veins. But it's not enough. I must defeat you. Those who've been blessed with the light to gain the true power of the crystal of fire now die. I'm good, bro. I kind of feel like living, so. He attacks me. That's not very cash money. Okay, maybe not as easy of a fight as I thought. Okay, so I died. Uh, let's uh, go back in and hopefully we will have. Uh, better luck the second time around. We're gonna be able to attack him, obviously, but um, the attacks will only do a couple hundred damage at a time. But these um, Arctic Winds should help a lot. Freezing Blade, ooh, that's gonna be good on. Um, and I tried stealing from him last fight, and it. Oh, no, no, no! Ooh, I caught it just in time. I was still in auto battle. I stole the first fight, and it only gave me a high potion, so I'm not going to bother stealing this time. So I'm just going to go ahead and use Arctic Wind. I'm going to attack with him, since he does good damage anyway. Item, I'm going to go ahead and use an Arctic Wind. And then a Blizzara. And that does a whole lot of damage, but I guess we'll see. How much does the Arctic Wind do? 600. Okay, that's not terrible. Ooh, 200 damage. Don't hit the same person. Okay, good, 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 good. If he doesn't hit the same person, I don't have a problem with him, honestly. 500? Okay. 
So let's see, that's uh, about a thousand damage, thousand eight hundred damage so far. Thousand eight hundred, about two thousand six hundred. Honestly, if I just, I might be able to kill him in two rounds if I just cheese him out. Articwin. I might be able to just cheese him out. Just use three Arctic Winds and a Blizzara. I could possibly cheese, because that's a whole lot of damage. Nine, almost 900. And this Blizzara does another, like, 900, 800, 700, okay, whatever. A couple hundred off. I know, and they have low magic damage, so it doesn't do as much. But this should get close to killing him at least. Okay, no. But he doesn't have time to... Don't hit... No, I was like, oh, this is what I didn't need to do. Nope, he's gonna kill like three people. Okay, he only killed one. Okay, I need a Phoenix down. <sighs> I hate using Phoenix down, but I really want her to get the XP, so I'm gonna do that. And then we're gonna do Arctic Wind. And then Arctic Wind, and this should kill him here. Phoenix down first, perfect. Okay, that's what I needed. Phoenix down first. And then um, these two Arctic Winds should kill him, so I think we're good here. Perfect. Alright, I wanted to get everyone to get the XP there, so. I still don't know if they're dead. Do they not get XP? I haven't, like, looked into this. I'm guessing they don't, because that's how in every other game how it works. Okay. They gained a level. Is he just dead? Just obtain the horns? Is he just... He's dead? He just, like, fell over a little. Alright. Fair enough. That must be the fire crystal. Warriors of Light. I will bless you with the light contained within my eternal flames. Bringers of Equilibrium, you must restore the light of hope lost from this world. You have been blessed with the power of fire. Okay. Some like it hot. Nice achievement. Okay, can I do anything with you? No? Is there some, like, chest with some loot up in here? Apparently not. Okay. I've been blessed with fire. Good enough, man. I don't know what that does. Does that give me more jobs or something? Give me more jobs, please. It does! I was right. Okay, we got knight and geomancer and scholar and ranger. So we got four more. Hmm, I'll have to look up at what those do. Okay, we should probably head back to the dwarves. Let's go talk to the main guy over here. Thank you again. Here, take this. It's yours. You'll find more in the village of Gazal. Obtain magic key. Oh, I did buy some of those already. Magic keys can open anything, but they'll break once you use them. Okay. Alright, good enough. Now, I'm pretty sure our treasure is yours. Follow me and behold the, the dwarven moonwalk. Come, come. This is this is what I wanted to see up in here. You know, the magic key, that's alright, but this guy's about to give me the good good. He has that good treasure. You guys will see what I'm talking about in a minute. Where's he at? Ooh, there it is. Alright, <clears throat> let's see. Got the Otter Shroom. Gauntlets. Scholar Robe. Scholar Hat. Knight Armor. Phoenix Down. Heroic Shield. Gizal Greens. Another Phoenix Down. Book of Light. <clears throat> Book of Ice. Book of Fire. Gold Needle. Killer Bow. Okay. And an elixir. Nice. Okay, let's see what the guy has to say. That's some good stuff right there. <clears throat> I hope our treasure is useful. Lee ha ho. I would say it's pretty useful. Okay, real quick. Is anyone dead? No. Let me look up these new jobs that I just got. Let me see if I'm going to convert anyone. I, I definitely think I'm probably going to switch out the thief for sure. But let me look at everyone else. Okay, guys. So, 
here's a couple of things I know for sure. Luneth is going to become a knight because a knight is basically just an advanced version of the warrior. So <clears throat> that's happening for sure. And I don't know. I don't. I don't think Ingus can be anything else just yet. I don't. He's not a monk warrior. I'm not turning him into another magic user. Could be. You know what? I could turn him into a ranger. I could turn him into a ranger for fun. But honestly, I think he's fine as a thief for now. Okay, so you know what? I'm gonna leave Ingus as a ranger. This might not work out, but you know what? For now, I'm just gonna do it. So we have a we have a killer bow. Also, I'm gonna take him off. From, I'm gonna put Luneth up front now, so, um, there we go. I wanna see, I think the knight looks sick, so I'm gonna keep him there. Oh, are you good, bro? Warriors of the Light, Tokul needs you. What's going on? Are you alright? Our village, we didn't have anything more for them to take. They're going to burn down Tokel. Please, you must stop them. What have they done? Ayn has a way to change his weak point. Only a scholar has the power to see through his deception. Could I could use a scholar, or I could just not, because I don't want to change to a scholar. That's weird. I don't I don't want to do it. So yeah. Okay, but guys, I'm gonna end the episode off here. If you guys enjoyed, make sure you like and comment as for the channel, and I'll see you guys later. God bless and goodbye.